This playthrough is sponsored by Game Toppers. Game Toppers are great if you want to deluxify the most important things in your life. Like board games. We were all thinking of board games. Hello fellow gamers, I'm Glory Hound and this is... Dr. Glory Hound. And today we're playing... Block and Key. By Inside Up Games. How are you all doing today? I don't know today? why I did that block like that. That was more of a punch. Block! And key. Oh. That could have been our nicknames. You'd be blocked for sure. I'd be <laughs> Why would I be blocked? I'm not the bigger person here. No, because you know karate and I can charm my way into anything. I'm the key. <laughs> okay, that's fair. That's fair. And hello to our chat today. It looks like we have Battle Cry in chat. How and are Hexy you doing? Beast. Oh, hi, a Hexy Beast. How are you doing? So this one's interesting. This one has like exactly 24 hours left. Listen, everyone, if you really like this game, like, get on it. Because yeah, it is like, you need time. to get on it, okay? What's going on, Chris? <laughs> so, violence says Battle Cry. It was not, you know, I'm personally not violent. But if you run into my fist, that's your own fault. I mean, just, it's like the stop hitting yourself. It's like, if you're just, like, just, walking, like... <laughs> I'm just punching as I walk. And if you get hit, it's your fault. I'm pretty sure that's how that works. I had a little brother. That's exactly That's how it works. That's exactly how that works. Yeah, I mean... I, I'm our... just throwing elbows. If you get hit, it's on you. Like, that's... <laughs> that's how we walk ball. through conventions. So we got to start practicing for later in the year. So... Mm. <laughs> all right. This is Block and Key. Now, I kind of want to show all of you the setup of this and kind of the hieroglyphic -y things and what they mean on the sides here because I really, really like what they did with this. This is the box. This actually came in a sleeve here. I mean, it's 2 a.m. and I wouldn't mind being knocked out, says Hexy. Well, that's fair, Hexy. Well, I call <laughs> this arm NyQuil and this one DayQuil. The both will get through his So, this is the box here. Um, what I'm doing right now. I'm going to go ahead and open up the box here. Here, I took out, you know, already some of the game components. Here was where the game components would be. And then here's the... I guess what are like the things that are gonna go well they're the things that are gonna go on it okay <laughs> here's the bottom of the board it's right very here very technical it's super technical okay i am very professional and technical everyone <laughs> you're actually gonna be setting up all of your cards and stuff here which you're gonna see from a different cam camera angle later but as for the over top view, I want to make sure that everybody had a nice clear view of this part of the board because you're not gonna see it as clearly as you are right now here are the sides has like, get in there, you, okay, there we go. It has like, this is not as important, but some of the other sides are really important. So Yeah, you showed off the not important sides. <laughs> First off, these things right here. So these actually tell you how many cards, what is it, to end the game for the, per yeah, the player count on it? Game. Do you want to go ahead and grab the other two there, doctor? So I can show everybody. Those will go on there. All right. No, you don't hold them there. Jeez, what's wrong with you? Okay. I said grab them. So, I so basically, every player is going to be able to see these. Wow, I need to do it the right way, too. So for... <laughs> okay, doctor. <laughs> You're... Are you contributing? Are you contributing to this? <laughs> this here says for solo, you would need 11 cards completed to win the game. Here, if you are playing with two players, so the two people here need 12 cards. If you have... Four players here, you're going to need seven cards. And if you have more than four players, kick them out. <laughs> and if you have three game. players, then you're going to need the eight cards here. I really like the fact that they involve these hieroglyphics in here with stuff that you're going to remember. And since you have two of these and they go on there, this is what you're going to be seeing from the sides here. Hmm. Like that. So then you have this information in front of you at all times. Like I really, really, really like that. Yeah, where's that helping hand? Oh, you need oh gosh, it? right? Everybody likes the helping hand. The helping hand. hand was very, very helpful, but also confusing, like, all at the same time. It was very helpful and very confusing. All right, so let's get these under here. Yeah, I mean, most games, like, they might try to, like, sneak it into the art like this, but it's, like, a real integral part of the art. So that's really it's nice. super integral, and that's what I loved about it. I was like, oh, my gosh, this takes nothing away from the actual game itself, and it so seamlessly, like, goes into it. Along here with the top, which we're going to actually put on top of here, I also want to show you the side of this one. That's the rules right there. Come on, you camera. Okay. So. Them is the rules. Yeah, right here. This is going to be the placement rules here. So this is saying if you're placing. Oh gosh. 
You can do it, camera. If you're placing a hey, it's the help of your hand, it's back. Brick here, and it's going to be like the same height. It has to be like adjacent to it here. If you're placing a brick, and you want it next to it, it has to be at least one block higher. This here is saying, oh, we love the fact that hey, if we are going to put a block on top of a block that they connect, but if it one is hanging off, then you get no like go. yeah, you get like the little. Uh, skull here, which I thought was so cool. It doesn't come with its own machete, but you can bring one with you. <laughs> I have a board game machete just in case. So I thought that was so legit. I was like, oh my gosh, that's amazing. Everything is so built into it. It's so perfect. Like, I just loved it. How did I mess up corner? It's hard to see with a camera being there and not being able yeah, to actually go this is actually, uh, this wire is part of the ancient ruins. So pay attention to that. <laughs> That's there because of the other camera that cannot so, get there any other way. The game is on the cutting board today because we have a whole separate camera angle that we're going to be showing you from this here. Boom. And we want to move this because... Please do not mind the burritos. Those are not <laughs> part of the show. This game is placed. You do the placement right here. And so I want to show you the placement and where you need to place things versus whenever you're actually looking at the game and how you're going to be scoring, because you're going to be scoring on your eyesight line right here, which I think is really, really important, okay? So she's going to spin it on me every time I'm about to do something good. hundred percent. Yeah, I'm just going to be like, wee! You know, I was thinking that the perfect thing would have been one of those... Chop block. Not a chop block. One of the... the spinning... Lazy Susan? Yeah, the Lazy Susan would have been perfect for this, right? I, need... what, I basically need a Lazy Susan. Why do they call it a Lazy Susan? Susan? They should call it a hardworking Susan. She's spinning all day long. Wow. Just, just saying. <laughs> okay, so the other thing with the hieroglyphics on the top of this here, this is orientated per player count. So here you're going to have four players, and your cube's going to go here. And then, of course, you're going to have everybody at their separate sides. Three players. You're going to have, I think we're going to have like one here and like two here or something like that. I like that. Hexy's like, if I left this set up, somebody's going to put their drink on it. Like, <laughs> yeah, I would recommend that. Especially on the bottom. But then you're placing this starting cube right here. I know I took that away from you as soon as you picked it up. I was yep. like, no. <laughs> you shall not For two player, pass. we're going to be playing right here. And then the cube's going to go here. And that's pretty much the setup. Oh, we need to set up the bottom of it too, Doctor. Do you want to yeah, so wanna get some bricks down there? I brought this bag out from somewhere else. So that way I wouldn't be, I would, I would be able to set them up randomly without, without any kind of shenanigans called. Oh my God, Doctor. Nailed it. Are you for real right now? <laughs> it's totally fine. Maybe yeah, I won't be you know putting what? these out. You know what? Why don't you give me all the blocks, Doctor? That's I don't think happens. you can handle this. You're looking up at the comments too much. You're just doing all sorts of ridiculousness. Should have painted the cord green. Then it would look like a vine coming out of the jungle. For real, right? That would have been fantastic. Where were you five hours ago? I mean, come to on be now. To fair, <laughs> this was a last minute disaster, okay? <laughs> We're trying our best, Hexy. <laughs> or Jay Peters. Or Battle Cry. You know what? All of you. All y'all. You're just doing it all at once. how hard it is to set up a whole new camera <laughs> angle for no reason. Yeah, the camera angle I was like stressed about because I wanted the right camera angle for this game because camera angle or just angle is so important in this game here. But so, also, we don't want to show you like our random computer bits that are all strung all over the place. Because except is for like this a, one garden-like wire, this garden-like wire right here. It's like a mad gorgeous, scientist lab up gorgeous, in here. Where stuff's okay. like there's tape on the wall. <laughs> definitely a drink. Definitely a drinking game. Yeah. No, the actual studio itself is held up with duct tape. Everyone, so we don't want to show you that. <laughs> and of course, this part here I love the most. It is at eye level for everybody so I can look directly into everybody's eyes and then also look at all my cubes right here. It's very important. Okay. Yeah, you made that really <laughs> awkward. So we have a secret objective. Okay. My secret objective is to not show you this card oh, and then I win. Well, that's nice. That's going to be mine there. Those are the cubes I'm going to want on my side where I'm looking at them. Oh, okay. I probably shouldn't look at that. Hello, Haunting Curse. How are you doing? Almost missed this one. I'm so glad to have you here. Are you guys going to play from the same side? No. So I'm going to actually play from, yeah, we tilt have to play this this way. Exactly. So and, I'm playing from here. Yep. And I'm playing from here. So camera angle wise. Don't copy me with that, that whole oh, again. Camera. Not that one. Jeez. Oh, camera angle wise. Doctor is going to be viewing this side of the camera. And I'm going to be viewing 
this side of the camera right here. Yeah, so you're going to be seeing yeah. what I see. So you guys so, be like, you idiot. When we score cards, I'm going to turn it so you all can kind of see how we're scoring versus how we're placing this on here. And okay? let me know if I need to knock the whole thing over again. <laughs> we get like two of these, right? Uh, yeah, we get two of the star cards, which are going to be like your starting cards here. Kind of look like that there. Mm. And these can be orientated in any way, but they can't be reversed, okay? They can't be inverted or anything. Hmm. And then That's we get one of this, one of the sun, one of the moon. One of the sun and one of the moon? One of the sun and one of the moon. Duns and duns. I don't know if, why I keep if, reaching if in you had, like, so deadly. I know, you need to like not, why are you even wearing a bracelet doing this, doctor? <laughs> Gotta represent. So if you... Had to choose if you were the sun or the moon, what would you be? The sun. The sun? Yeah. Hold on. I get everybody real hot. Oh, that's why. Because you get everybody real hot. Chat, is this true? Are you all steamy right now? <laughs> I basically bring life to the planet. Without me, the planet dies. Oh, okay. I say. <laughs> I mean, the moon does good stuff. Don't you like catch asteroids every once in a while? Like, you know, just pew off your butt. I feel like Dr. Glory Hog is going to be like the Indiana Jones of this temple here for later in the stream today. <laughs> She's like, open You're this already chest. set up. Whoa! I'm going to be like, here, take this idol. Make sure to look at it. <laughs> I will say this is the first temple that I've seen that has been updated with hardwood floors. You know what? That's new in temples, okay? That's a new feature That's in most temples. It's pretty standard yeah. in all the new chic temples. <laughs> all right, so... Oh, the other thing we have to do is we have to pick three from here. And not just any three. It's either like horizontally or vertically. So you get to pick three cubes that you start with in like your pool. And you can only have a maximum of seven. I should probably look at my cards. This here, very deadly. Everything I do is dangerous. And then it refills and then I will oh, choose I will not be refilling this for the you. thing. And the stuff with Do the stuff and really the things. Do you really want me to refill this for you? I <laughs> would like for you to refill things it's because dangerous. that is the rules. Them's the rules, Doctor. Them's the rules. Okay, like, I feel like maybe, I mean, I want all the colors, but okay, there is one line with all the colors. Maybe I should start what there. What are you showing me? Is that brown on my side do this over here? here? We're taking these ones right here. The fluorescent lighting is making this more difficult than it needs to be. All right, to be. fill us up. Fill us up, Doctor. What do the cubes taste like? I don't have probably, not put these in my mouth. I would imagine they probably taste like hands. Because. Because <laughs> people have been touching these. I'm pretty sure I'm not the first person to have received this copy, everyone. Jeez. <laughs> the schnozberries taste like schnozberries. All right, Doctor. So for the cube, you're going to go first. If you want, you can go ahead and like rotate this however you want. You just have to have this like burnt orangey one on top. So you have like burnt orange, green, or white. Yeah, just leave it fine. I'll make whatever works. So like this? No, whatever works. Um, that was, you just said whatever works and then you twisted it. Is that the white side <laughs> facing me? <laughs> it is, it is. Do you know if Becca Scott has played this? I don't think so. <laughs> the jerk. All the germs probably died during shipping. You don't know that for certain. It's cold right now, so germs last a little bit longer in the cool air, okay? I think so, right? Yeah. Don't germs last longer in cool air? Probably. It's the hot air that's, like, not good, or maybe the hot air is better for them. I'm not for sure. All right. I've already scored. Oh, gosh. Okay. Round one. Score. All right. So, I've got this bad boy here. So, I've got two whites and then two greens. For the right bottom the portion bottom. Yep. right here. Right along the bottom. So that's one point, baby. Oh. I'm gonna draw a new one. Doctor, how do you how do you keep up with all this like here? I'm just too good. <laughs> <laughs> all right, let me uh, check out my Holy, stuff. This one my was things and my stuff. Okay. Interesting. Um <coughs> excuse me. It's all the um, It's all the ruins dust. All the dust in the ruins. I think this one is blue. Everyone's pretty like white cubes. You probably licked some of the pieces. Ew. To be Ew, fair, everyone. you take enough pictures with you with dice in your mouth, and people just assume. Ew. Whatever they think Becca's licked them. Everyone. 
Oh, yeah. See, they've had complaints about them putting components in her mouth all the time. So, yeah, Becca has licked them, apparently. Oh, my gosh. Probably. What? Okay, let me put it, like, right here. Okay, I see what you're doing here. Okay, okay. And then I'm going to yeah, score me some Yeah, the lighting is buff. always going to be tough because it's such a bright white light. It score makes me things some stuff. interesting. But that is. This is a brown up here, and this yellowish is, like, white for me. Oh, my gosh. This is a lot of twisting. Nobody cares about your card. All right. Ba boom It's legal. I also scored one point, Doctor. How do you feel about that? How does that make you feel? Dead inside. <laughs> that makes you laugh? Your husband's pain makes you yeah, laugh. Yeah, it does. It does. It does. I hope that you lose. Somebody <laughs> once told me this world was gone. Yeah, the yellow color is supposed to be white and the gray is supposed to be blue. So, since this is a prototype of the game, I'm sure that they're going to be able to fix all of the color portions Well, of and part of that, that is, like, and the extreme lighting that we have. Yeah, we on. do have extreme lighting in here. So, you're, like, we're already on kind of, like, a little bit bluer spectrum and stuff like that in here anyway. I know they were saying the final product will match the cube color with the card better. The actual cubes themselves I really, really like because, like, they're super solid feeling. Like, I'm a big fan of the cubes, and they're kind of fun. They feel like gigantic Tetris pieces, exactly how you would expect. I scored this bad boy. Boom. A little white. Is that another one? green, yeah. Why are you like this? They're very close to each other. Why don't you score something bigger, Doctor? I mean, nope. geez. Nope. One pointers for life. Jeez. Why don't you, like, do something that's going to, like, challenge you a little bit? What did you even put over here on my side? This is not cool. Nothing. I'm not, ha I'm not down with what's happening ah, here. Ah, what? What? Ah, what? <laughs> I dropped something. Ah. I'm freaking out. Ah. Okay. What color is this? I don't even know. Um, like, there's so many choices. The, oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no, no. Okay. Is this, this one's white or blue? That one's blue. That one's blue. Why, why did you do that? <laughs> <laughs> I think so I'm going to actually need to So, they can touch each other more. as long as it goes higher. But since it's not going higher, they have to touch corner to corner. Mm hmm Absolutely. Yeah, corner to corner if it's an even space, but since I was able to place this one and this one is three here going up, then we're able to put it right there. I think I'm going to have to get more cubes from the bottom here. Which, because the idea is that it still looks the same to me. It drastically changes on her side what she sees, but to me it still looks from the mm -hmm. front that it's they're next to each other, even though one might be... I love the front. spatial awareness portion of this game. It's so much fun. Oh, look, there's my burrito hanging out. Wondering what we're going to pick for Friday. What? Right there in the camera. <laughs> what are you going to pick for Friday, Doctor? Well, what do we even have on our Friday game Everdell, thing? There's Everdell, and okay. then there's Super Fantasy Brawl, mm -hmm. and there is, oh gosh, I saw something else. That's good. Oh, there's the Three Sisters, which is a roll and write by people who did Fleet. Right, we're going to take these. All right, can you fill me up? She doesn't care what I just said. The three sisters, the people that did Fleet. Mm -hmm. I was listening. Fleet the dice game. They I was were listening. That's the, this is their newest role, right? I forgot to like refill my hand with cards. It's gonna take these, I guess. How dare you? How dare you, Doctor? <laughs> I guess I will take these. I love Fleet the dice game, so that's gonna be amazing. Yeah, actually, it looks it looks really good. I'm actually pumped for it. Actually. <sighs> actually. Actually. Yeah. So the cat did jump up here when we were playing it earlier. Oh yeah. And she like just. Mm -hmm. Like, side-checked it, and the whole thing just was like, <laughs> we're like, oh, okay, good. So I'm hoping my kid will catch That's the cat a before problem. that happens again. That's a problem. All right. I can put, I need to do, like, I think I'm going to do this thing for, like, two points. How do I get knocked down? How do I get up again? Okay, Sorry. so. I was bud jumping. Oh, can I even do that? I don't think I can. I gotta do like this card here. I wanna do this card here, everyone. It's not You'll working out for me. It's not never. working out for me. <laughs> it is not going exactly as planned. At least she hasn't drowned any of my meeple so far in this game. Okay, so as long as this one here is like on something, 
that's fine. That's fine if it's even. If it's I've it's built... all supported, it's completely supported, it's totally fine. I built Excalibur. It's gonna score me this card. No, oh, all the people inside. What? Are you? Are Did you, you score just, something? I think so. I think I just nobody I wants scored to a thing. See. It's like I feel like we're chancing fate right here, right now. I do not know how solo would work for this. Oh, there, there is a solo. Yeah. I am, you know, I passed right by that in the rules. I apologize. Like, I should have gone, I should have done that. All right, so that's a two pointer. I mean, I didn't do just my one point oh, and there's a one point. Of turns you get. It's timed. <laughs> you do have to finish, though, like 12 cards. That's crazy. With the solo, though, it's like timed. Yeah. With 12 cards on the solo is tough, right? Is it one higher? So that one is resting upon another one. So as long as everything is like okay resting upon everything, you don't have any edges hanging off, it says in the rules that you can rest them. It says, and it's on the side. You can rest it on another cube. <laughs> right, well, that's what my channel has done. Oh, dang it. You know what, Hexy? I will go ahead and take a look at the rules and at the in the comments of this video, I'll go ahead and let you know, okay? So you can just come back to the video and check it out. All right, I gotta figure out what else I'm doing here. And Glory Howe knew that was a lie. She would never <laughs> leave a comment. What? She doesn't even have access to the YouTube channel. What? What? I have, I have all the accesses. What? Do you? Do you know? I, I, th I think it. I have the accesses. Yeah. <laughs> now you're a little worried. Like, hmm, do I have access? Do I have the accesses? I don't know. I don't do know. you? Uh. It's like, I get knocked down. Why am I singing that song? I apologize. I apologize. You don't. I do. You don't. That's not even a good song. All right, song. I think actually I'm just going to take some more cubes. <laughs> you fool. I mean, okay. <laughs> I'm going to go right here. That's going to complete one for me. Nailing them. Not happy. Go ahead. You switch the cam. I'm going to do the... One, two, three, four, five, oh, six, seven. Perfect. That's all. All right, so look how ridiculous <laughs> this it. is, right? This one here wants the brown. So I got two browns, and then I've got three blues, and then one of the whites, which looks yellow. That's Ooh, accurate. Oh, yeah. That's nice. And they're all at varied. There we go. See? Look at it. You're at varied. Isn't that so weird? It needs to be like perfection and throw blocks everywhere. <laughs> the Just, oh, that would be amazing. We had Jenga boom for a while, which is pretty cool because oh, it would do that. Oh, that's terrible. After a while, it just blows up, and you're like, all right, cool, cool, cool. And you're like, and that was a thing. <laughs> I guess all right. Refill. This is going to get dangerous. Is it? So dangerous. Okay, I think, every okay, here's I, my initial, my here's my here, plan. I just right start here. shaking, I'm like. <laughs> all right. I'm not qualified for this. I think I'm going to put this here. If you put hydraulics in the bottom of your game table, any game can be like perfection. <laughs> and that's going to be the two orange and the two white on that one. That's my third card. Oh, dang it. That was only a one point card. Oh, no. I worked so hard for one point. <laughs> Not worth it. All right. Well, that happened, everyone. Is it my turn? That happened. It is. Make sure you're drawing up cards in your hand. You should have four. I do have four. Oh, it's just me not paying attention. I don't like them, though. So I'm going to throw them in the ocean. I'm like eyeballing over here. I'm like, okay, we're exactly, okay, yeah, mm -hmm, I see. I see. I like what I'm seeing. I like, I think I like what I'm seeing. All right, as you go, I had to collect more pieces. This is like, geez, like, which one do I go for on here? All right, I think I'm going to do this is a good one. This is a good play Every time right you here. place blocks, do a shot of Red Bull. Whoa, that would be <laughs> intense. This is a good one. Everyone, I'm so proud of myself. I'm so proud of myself. And it's mostly just because Dr. Glory Hog, like, placed a bunch of stuff. And then now I also get to have, like, a really long one here as well now. Green, Boom. Brown, brown, brown. Mm. I would like to thank the doctor 
for That's... this glorious oh oh is this blue not white oh i think it is isn't it did i mess up yeah <gasps> Yep, you're looking at blue. Oh, no. This block here, though, is that one blue? That one is, yeah. Or is that one white? That one's blue. Blue. Is that one? That one's blue, too. These ones Never are white. mind. Oh, awkward. I was so proud of myself. I'm so upset. So upset. You're upset. Pay no to... attention to that card in my hand, Doctor. <laughs> I had to watch that unfold, and it made me sick. Like, I just... Whatever. Grew up. Whatever. How bad that was. Oh, this is getting hard. I need okay, to try I need to make this thing like well, I'm still gotta place something different then. Hmm, how convenient. Oh gosh, what am I gonna do? What am I gonna do here? Convenient? Do that. Did you get all your hopes and dreams? I did get them ruined. I'm really sad about it too, Doctor. Don't make me sadder. <laughs> Seems like you have no idea how you're doing against the competition in the game. Oh, that's a good question. That's a good question. So, like... Well, you can kind you... of figure out if they've completed a bunch or not. Yeah, so as far as scoring cards and stuff like that, you have score cards that you have available. So, like, I've finished three and you've finished three on that one. So, you can kind of see the points on those. And the points on them... And show the camera. Really I would imagine four player would be like so weird because someone would be directly on the opposite side of you doing something and, and giving you like new things to look at potentially. And then your special card is going to make sure that you get extra points on top of those score car score cards, which we'll talk about whenever we get to it. I don't know what I'm going to do here though. Like I had like a plan and it was set in place and then this plan just like got wrecked. Did it get rickety wrecked or just regular wrecked? It definitely got rickety wrecked. I'm not happy about the rickety wreckedness of the plan. Boom. And I can like do this. maybe I need like a thing. Whoa, 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 and some whoa. Stuff. First off, <laughs> why are you placing stuff where you can't even see it? What do you mean? Get out of here with that business. What do you mean, doctor? Someone says that corner is not tucked. Uh, one of the corners is off. That's all right. It's pretty stable. Is it? Oh, yeah. you're right. It's okay. That's actually going to be the finale of this game. <laughs> <laughs> if we get enough weight on that one corner, it's going to trigger the game finale. Yeah. It su does surprisingly well. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry. I know I'm taking forever as long as on this. doesn't spill like a soda on it, I think you're good. Or like a really wet dog just laid on it. <laughs> that would be bad. Okay, so if I do this... Oh, we're definitely messing each other up. Because what are you doing right now? I don't know what I'm doing right now, Doctor. It's all bad. It's She's bad, bad, up, bad. Jay okay, it's like not good stuff happening, okay? Remember, I think definitely it's probably going to play best at four because there would be somebody right, directly on the opposite this. side of you with doing things. Right, also ahead. trying to have that same plane of view and you'd be like all up in each other's business. I need to like orientate my cards. I swear I was better at this whenever I didn't have the camera on, okay? <laughs> She was not. What are you doing, doctor? What are you going doing? Up. You're going up? Yep. You gotta like squish that block on there. How dare you? <laughs> How dare you, ma'am? Don't touch my blocks. Blocks are a man's castle. Your turn. My turn already. Okay, so I have this one, I have those. Got that. We need like something there. Oh geez. I just should do this. This is gonna be like too much stuff. You definitely can place blocks and ruin people's patterns. Okay. Your turn. Yeah, don't complete a line of blocks or it'll just go through. All right, so check this out. Flip this bad boy. I will not. <laughs> Look how ridiculous this is. This is like the best. All right. What's uh, happening here? There's like this little walled off cave and stuff like that. So I got to see if everyone can see it the way I see it. It's so ridiculous. All right. Is this where so, I should fix the corner, everyone? No. So I needed to have three brown and then whites on both sides, right? And I totally do. Although this one is like super far forward, it technically does block this one from my point of view now, if you were straight, you know, at eye level with it. And so this is like, it shows me that I've got four white blocks here, three browns, and then two white blocks right there. And that counts. Booyakasha. <laughs> as the turtles would say. It's important. Let's see here. That's another one. Let's That's see. Oh, just sort one. of a guess because you don't know what's in their hand. You can also kind of, so the multiplier on this, you can kind of figure out which 
blocks their multiplier is for if they're going for a particular type of block and trying to get like a bunch of random stuff down on that. If that makes sense. I hope that makes sense. Or maybe like you can try to go it ahead didn't. and say like white was your color. Then you would try to get other cards that also had white in them and complete those cards and leave the other ones in your hand and try to just go for something like that. So you're like doubling up on your points. So you can go ahead and figure it out a little bit like that. I believe it's still my turn, though. Let's see here. That is what do happens. a thing. Yeah, after my do turn, a thing. you take a turn. And the stuff. I'm going to. Yeah, and it's definitely a sort of guess. But anytime somebody's manipulating a board that you're also trying to work off, they can definitely mess up your plans. Mm. Need to do that. This is like an awfully big cube to this use for this. This like cherry chapstick. That's awkward. <laughs> Somebody definitely had that one in their mouth. <laughs> All right. Made an arrow. We're going to do... These blocks are like weighted nicely. You could Jeez. basically just play with the blocks, I think. Play with the blocks. Got it. Got There's it. The green one. Yep, look at that. I made a little house. I need to like be able to put this on top of here. Oh, not working. It's not working. Everyone, this is like amazing. Not working. Look at this, what I did here. This is just, it's that good. Look at that. Doctor. Yes, what? Are you just messing around at this point? <laughs> what? <laughs> Are you just messing around? I made like a little, it's like a I torch in like Minecraft or something, I think. Dang it, I'm going to have to get more cubes, I think. This is not going well for me. This is Terra bad. I am embarrassed. <laughs> I'm embarrassed for you. I'm embarrassed. I'm getting some cubes, everybody. I do not think that is a good idea, small Why? human. You're going underneath a tripod. Why does like Scoot back out? This perspective matter so much. <laughs> All right. So we're although I'm a little up. worried, solo is beat your own score probably. Yes. Yeah. It would have I would to say be. so. Whoa! 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 Did you grab cubes yep. too? Okay. Here we go. I already have a plan for my cubes though. So. I'm gonna try to breathe. Let's try to breathe a little bit. Are you like getting like stressed because you're trying to do all this on camera? Yeah. No? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> they need a, a block that can make other blocks be removed when placed. Oh! Like a bomb. Burn. Jeez. All right, so if I have those there, I have that there. If I had a hammer, I could definitely change this whole thing up. A bomb block. I have that there. Ba -ba 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 Boom. That would make things pretty crazy. Oh, I still need a thing on that There could one. be like a sinkhole, too, where like you put a block on there and it just goes right through because there's a hole in the board. What? Which one? There should be like a hole in the board so that if you like, you take your block and you're like, doo -doo 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 -doo, and it just falls through. Because there was a sinkhole there. Okay, I think I need to put like this, like so. I'm gonna try some new strats, everyone. Okay, <laughs> this is not going well. I think so. I don't know. Flip the camera on for reasons. I'm so bad. All right, so look at this ridiculousness, right? Like we've already, I'm already like just doing weird stuff here. So that bad boy goes there. So now what you got yourself there is, I've got two greens and a brown and a white, and then I've got three whites and then three greens, and all I really needed was three whites and two greens and that oh, killing it counts i'm up to five now. i don't know what's happening with the Ooh, bomberman game since it's hands of idw i'm feeling it's going to go the way of the metal gear game Ooh, okay that's interesting all right you can have this back how now. many cards do you have done i'm so five. far behind behind right now everyone i'm one ahead of you i am I'm destroying my competition at three I'm at you're three. being destroyed by my competition. <laughs> you are right. at one last. No, you're at four done. They're I'm all up put there. this here. I can see them. I can. Oh no, one of those is your. <gasps> one of those is your secret objective. Yeah, really one of them. Oh, that's actually. Three. Oh no. I'm supposed to have that secret objective. Okay. Maybe yeah. I no, I'm at three, but I did complete you. this one for two points. So there's that. So there's always nice. that. I don't want this. Thank you. All right, doctor, go ahead. Mimic test. <laughs> I made the mistake of saying something about a chest, and all of a sudden a mimic chest showed up. That's awkward. <sighs> it was. It's your own fault. This is because of you. One, two, three, four, five. All right. 
want to do that one, but that one's going to be what the kids call hard. <laughs> Walk hard. I thought I had like a great plan to make this T one work, and then it's just not going to. And so I'm what pretty disappointed drop, by that. It's my turn, right? Yes. Okay. What if I did this? Does this help you in any way? If Probably just, not, but you should do it anyway. I take this giant T and I just block your whole area off with it. Does that help? Did I need to do it that way? I don't know. Maybe. Maybe I did. Hmm. 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 I don't know. Did you need to do it that way, Doctor? I don't know. Did you need to drown all my meeples? Um, what is this? What is, what is, what now, is this? when you have a card that has a space in the middle, can there still technically be a block in there? In yeah. The middle? Okay. But if it means that you don't place that, then no. No regrets. <laughs> worth it. <laughs> the victory in here will be worth it, even if it's an overall this loss game in the seems campaign. Right for the unintentional international, or intentional, unintentional. Intentional table, table flip. flip. Yeah, that's why this one corner, I left this one corner all janky so I can just. Ah, <laughs> oh, Doctor. I. The advantage is you can just use this as a small end table next to your couch. Dislike Put you. Put your drink on it. Very much. She's got that look on her eye. Do what she says. Nah, I'm all right. <laughs> Sometimes there's the old adage that happy wife, happy life, but I believe that slightly annoyed wife, happy wife. <laughs> what? I don't know why. It just makes things spicy. Calahante. All right. <gasps> okay, that's enough happy <laughs> you. What are you doing? I'm trying to figure out what the heck I'm doing, Doctor. <laughs> uh, why am I so bad at this? Wise men say only fools run. Okay, I think I need to like put this. That was wrong. Not a good move. But I'll allow it. Like, I don't feel like I you're even like placing your stuff. Swimming. Yeah. That's horrible. We left that game up for like three days too, because I was like convinced that we would play it again so I could get my sweet revenge. But then she always found excuses. Okay, so I think so if somebody's you the earlier really stream off. with Ellen where they were talking about games they had played. There was a helping hand, and now there's this other. Is your person helping hand getting like ridiculous right now? Giving me a fork. A fork. It's a dingle hopper. <laughs> okay. For combing my hair. I completed a card, everyone. Please. Don't spin the board. No standing ovations. No standing much. ovations, everyone. Don't okay? spin the board. It's too much. <laughs> Just put it down. I believe you. I believe you. At least your wife will game with you. Yeah. 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 Doctor. Yeah. At least your wife will game with you. <laughs> uh, can you please turn on the camera? You I have better, one that I need to You spark. better. Why do you get to show off yours and you, I can't show off mine? Was men say. <laughs> I'm a fool. All right. So check this business out. We got ourselves a triple green. <laughs> boom, boom, boom. And a triple brown. Boom, boom, boom. Space in between. I think five. that's probably One, the game two, there, three, right? Four, five, six. Huh? Is it 11? No, it's 12 cards. 12 cards. Yeah, I have like six. How many do you have? Five. <laughs> okay. Caught okay. up. Sort of. None we'll of them are good up. cards, though. I like though. it, though. I like it. It's None getting, of them are fantastical. It's getting wild. Just letting y'all know. Let's get wild. Let's get wild. Let's okay, let's see it. what I got here. Let's take some inventory. I need. No, like. Take some inventory. Like totes inventory. Mm -hmm. Inventory. Totes At this point, inventory. I wish I could like throw these behind me and stuff. I could be like, Psh, get out of your card. I don't need you. It's too close to the end of the game. Okay, okay. I see what I got going on here. Oh, hold little on. little double layer hold player on. board is what you think you'd want, like, on top of the game board so they wouldn't slide off. I think that could happen, but here's the thing, though. This is the whole box, though. You have to remember that, too. This is the bottom and top of the box that you're using to make this. So, I don't know if that would make it weird, because then you'd have a box that had, like, a slight ridge on the top of it. And, I don't know, I think people would freak out. 
okay, okay, okay. I see what's going on here. I see what's going on. Like, you know, we, I think the turning is like making the blocks like slide bloop. slightly. Yeah, bloop a little. There we go. Now, how are we going to play this? We're going to play like once we both hit 12, we're going to play one more round and that's it? Like once we both have hit a total of 12 objectives or are we going to play it where we each have to individually get 12 objectives? This is I, I wasn't terrible. personally 100% sure how that This worked. is terrible. Hold on. I need complete concentration, doctor. I think you need to read the rules if you don't know. <laughs> I told you this already that I didn't understand it. Because I am trying to get stuff done on my last turn here. It is not working out very well. I'm getting really sad. Oh, I could do that. I mean, everything is totally fine. I know exactly what I'm doing. <laughs> I don't think you do. I know exactly what I'm doing. And that was Just kidding. A lie. I have no idea what I'm doing. Why do you lie to our fans? <laughs> okay, I think I'm going to do like this over here. <laughs> I'm going to be able to get this card. Yes! <laughs> Finally! <laughs> All right, it's good. Finally! Finally! Got it. <laughs> Barely. <laughs> that was the one I was trying to get. Barely. All right, so you are the first player, so I believe it's like you would have, like, if you completed it, then I would have one last just turn. Each get one more oh, I don't know. Oh, maybe we each. Where are the rules at? We each get one more turn. I don't okay. know. They're over there. All right, somewhere. go ahead. Super do you fun. just want to complete something? Is that what no, it is? No, I don't think I can. Or do you just feel bad for me and you want me to complete something? Is that what it is? <laughs> you can. You can. I'm just going to do this. You can't bloops in here, Doctor. I already did. Bloops. So the way the rules are written, which is obviously, like we said, this is a prototype, you could read it as in you have to score 12 individually and then go off of that, or you could do it off of once 12 keys have been, or 12 of these puzzles have been solved, then you go into endgame scoring. You really do it either way. But I have tacos waiting for me in the other room, so we're going to do it the, my way. <laughs> the it's taco all about way. them tacos, huh? Oh, here's another thing. Okay, so. Yeah, please tell us about this taco related. If you have a card that you can complete that's already on the board, you cannot actually complete it unless you're using a cube, like you're putting down a cube. Yeah, you still have to lay a cube in order to complete it. In order to it. do that. And here's the cool thing, though. If you put down a cube and you complete so cool. multiple cards at that time, then you get, that you get to do multiple cards. You have to scream out Jumanji. And no. then spider monkeys come flying out of your closet. No, absolutely Narnia. not. Absolutely I'm going to yell out Jumanji not. again this year. I did it last year and it was funny. No. 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 It was not funny, Doctor. <laughs> That's how I feel about tacos right now. Are you just hungry? You're like really hungry? I got to figure out if I can finish it's one more card. Thursday. Figure out if finish one more card. I feel like I could. Okay, three, four, five. Oh, dang it. I don't have the blocks for that one. I don't think I have the blocks for any of these. I have these blocks. Get blocks. These blocks are not going to help me. Come on, not baby. Gonna help make me with that blocks. one. Get, get, get blocky. I feel like I could. Come on, baby. Make your blocks. Right now. I don't know why they don't have me do all the jingles for every Kickstarter. I need I like, like one I've green one there. Nailed. I can't do that. Is green your secret objective? You hush your butt, doctor. I don't want to hear anything else out of you. I'm glad we held that I'm so done real. with you right now, <laughs> doctor. I like how whenever Battle Cry tries to say something, they hold it for review. Why do they always hold Battle Cry? They always hold Battle Cry accountable. You got to wonder what Battle Cry is saying, saying on other YouTube yeah, channels. Yeah. Battle Cry. All right. I'm doing that one right there. Ba Boom. Oh, you got another one done? Boom. That might have you win. All right. So then right. we look at our secret objectives, which the whole idea is. I to don't see remember what mine was. So. How many of those things are on your side? So I can see one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, here, let me turn to here so nine, you can kind of show everybody. 11. So I see 11 browns from my perspective. So you've got to divide it by three. So, and you're supposed to round down. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11. Is there 12? Is there one like in there? I don't know, there could be. Let's say 12. Make right the math there. easy. So that's four. Okay. So that means I get to add four to all my different objective cards here. What about you? Was yours green? Mine was blue. Oh, oh God. So three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I think that's white right there, right? That one is no, blue. No, that's blue. Nine, 10, 11, 12 as well. 12 as well. Oh, so four. Nice. 
right. Nice. I'm very pleased with that. So what is it? 12 and then you, uh, so you're, three? So you're going to add four to all your oh, cards. Oh, four to all of them? Okay. Yeah, so you take how many you can see and you divide it by three and you round down if you need to. Oh, dang it. I totally messed up. I'm going to need a calculator. <laughs> I'm going to need a calculator. Right. I don't want to mess up. Thank you. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And then I'm going to count loudly so uh, it messes you up. Booyah, booyah. I don't know how many points I got. It's this many. <laughs> and a half. All right, what'd you get? Oh, I got a very special number, everyone. I got 40. What'd you get? Forty-two. <laughs> oh, the meaning of life. <laughs> <laughs> These are quite heavy. <laughs> 42. Okay. I actually feel better. I feel like. Good game. People think that I'm salty, so I have to be like this. Good game. You were a worthy <laughs> opponent. <laughs> <laughs> Champions Hold on, I love spatial awareness games, and I felt like I really struggled, and so I'm super happy that like do I you, actually. Do you feel like your spatial was aware? My spatial was not aware, everyone today. Oh, it was not aware spatially. I'm sorry. Oh gosh. <laughs> Plus, you can store your cards like this for the youngins. No. <laughs> yeah. But I'm really happy that I won because I was for sure that you were gonna wreck me. Did you just get a bunch of like low cards? Hold yeah, on, I'm gonna I had, see. Well, I'm gonna I had look. two ones, a two, and three fours. Okay. But you ended up getting seven, right? Yeah. So seven, even though yours were all lower, then you, got an extra you just four got points. extra yeah. extra yeah. points on that. Because you were able to complete one at the end, I wasn't. I was not able to complete one at the end. Surprisingly, a very very tight game. I thought you were gonna blow me out of the water. You're a very tight game. That's true. That's true. <laughs> <laughs> so, Doctor, what else do we have planned this week? Good game. We are going to be playing Pendulum. You need to learn that game, by the way. Why do I need to learn it? Why can't you learn it? Because <laughs> I don't got real time for that. What do you mean? It's a real time I game. learned this game, so I feel like you should learn the next one. Ooh. Oh. I mean, if you wanted me to learn this one, so then you learn the next. That's that's how the rules work. That's how the thing goes. This is your job. <laughs> you need to do it. Do your job. Do your All job. All right, everyone. So we're going to be playing That's Pendulum on court. Thursday. We're going to be doing our Kickstarter show on Friday. I haven't decided if I have another thing planned Friday because I have to, like, check my schedule and all sorts of other stuff. Check we the We also check are going to be sketch. doing some fun stuff for Mythic games. Like, we're going to be doing some commentary. If you enjoyed our Mythic tournament where we talked about kind of what was going on during the tournament thing of that, except like mixed with our hype hype train. And we're gonna be doing something like that for Mythic. Uh -huh. I know, I'm just sure. gonna throw that out there. I'm just gonna throw that out there. So Hexy says, I thought Pendulum was a bit of a dud as a solo game, really. I don't know, I haven't played it as solo. I'm trying to think of which game it was that had like, I thought it was one of Stone Mayer's games that had like a fantastic Automa. Which game was it? Which game you was it that I really loved? Wingspan or Euphoria? It was one of those two. I think I may have been Wingspan. I think the Wingspan Automa was like was pretty my solid. favorite. And pretty I don't solid. play many of those, like Automas. I don't, of the Automas like that in games. Like I don't play many you of them. You don't play very much solo. You've, you've played a few solo games. Right, I've played solo games, That's but because, not like that. I mean, you technically, you're a person that'll sit like with one of those little logic puzzle books and be like, mm, I'm gonna solve some puzzle before I go to bed. And I'm like, ew, gross. Who doesn't want to solve puzzles before they go to bed? Chat, do you solve puzzles before you go to bed? You know what we're talking about, right? The little logic-y puzzles where it's like- I know I'm wearing like, glasses, but she's definitely the nerd. <laughs> it has like mm. the little, if boxes Billy, that you fill in. If Billy got there before Susie, but Susie got there before Maggie, but Maggie's always two minutes late. Who got the red ice cream? And you're like, 
<laughs> Billy, I don't care. <laughs> Somebody. The goblin under the table was just, just laughing about that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Weirdo. Oh, oh, I'll play card. All right. Oh, oh but see, oh, okay, so. She left her card. Jay the Peters Joker. says, but see, you had no idea how you were doing in a game compared to your opposition. So, I guess, maybe, I don't know, like, I felt like in the end, I definitely was able to push the cards so quite actually, a bit. So, the scoring was a little bit Euro y then in that way because it wasn't like where we had a scoreboard that we could see where everybody right, was at. Right, right. You kind of had to kind of look over there and then make your best estimations, but there was a secret objective card. So, like, this could have swung wildly either way. Oh, but definitely. You also, like I said, you also did definitely. score seven of them, right? I scored six, and that made a big difference. Yeah, at the end, I was able to loop back around. So, I think in the beginning, I really, really felt I was doing badly because, Doctor, you were ahead a couple of cards, but by the end, I had at least caught up, and then I got one more, and I really, really tried to get at least one more card than Doctor because I felt like my cards were a little low at the time, and so I felt like I needed the extra points on that. Damn it! So it wasn't like a complete, like, ah, uh, I don't know. Like, it, in the beginning, I felt like I was behind. And at the end, <gasps> I felt like I was going to do at least decently. I probably didn't pay as much attention to my other card as I should have. But luckily, you didn't pay attention to it a whole bunch either. Because we got the same on that. I tried messing you up by dropping that one thing. You did. Way. Did it mess you up? I was already messed up at that point, so <laughs> I don't know if that's what you could have done. Jenga. Doctor, this is why we can't have things in front Jenga. of you when we're talking. Yeah, I know. Okay, you know what? Logic puzzles are awesome, says Jay Peters, right? Okay, so I like games that you don't know if you're winning or losing until the end, or else I give up early, and I kind of agree with that. So That is a nice thing about kind of that hidden scoring or like hidden objectives that you can kind of come back at the end. People are like, what? And you're like, yeah, I knew the whole time I was winning, but I didn't want to tell you. I like hidden objectives, too, because... You have everybody 100% in, not even, not just the people that are behind, but also if you are playing, like, you don't ever have that time where you're like, eh, I can slack off and stop paying attention, like, be on my mm. phone, like, ugh, I know, I'm I'm winning, it's fine, you know? We played of the Elder Veil, and I was behind by, like, 20 points until we started doing some endgame scoring, and then we yeah. like, right around that board. And I, and I love, 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 love games like that. I hit 98 like points, and that was fun to be at the back. I made sure everybody else scored first, too, so I got to go... Here's the thing. Doctor does this stuff just to make himself feel like tons better. You'll purposely wait until the end and be like, oh no, I didn't win. Oh, look at all the points. Oh, oh my god. Oh no, I didn't win. Oh, yay me. <laughs> That's what Doctor does. Huh. It's an exact impression of you while you're playing. All right, everyone, thank you so much for hanging out with us today. We really appreciate it. If you are interested in Block and Key, make sure to go ahead and check that out on yeah. Kickstarter because they got 24 hours, hours for it. If you like logic y sort of games, spatial just awareness. Want a way to get some Tetris like pieces, this is the way. That's true. And Tetris like pieces. If you're interested in any of those things, I would check it out. Because I think the game was like, what, less than 40, right? It all was the games pretty inexpensive. Last, I think all the games we covered last week were like around 40 or less. So. I really liked the fact. That's why we call her cat. I really like the fact that all two it goes like into like a really nice little box and all kind of like yeah they did a really good job into each box. other. That was fantastic. And then on the hieroglyphics, that was fantastic as well. So, Hexy, get some sleep. We'll talk to all of you later. Battle cry. Stay awake. <laughs> Bye.